Rock Over London, Rock On Chicago, Pontiac, We Build Excitement. So, alright, okay, something new for the day. Bringing you massive value, as I would say, in every type of way I can think of. And today that's going to be what I see with the money going, flowing from the stocks to the crypto. And uh, I'm going to talk about what's going on with that right now. I'm going to talk about what I see. Uh, I'm going to talk about, you know, where I think this is going as far as like trends go. So yeah, getting into it. And before I do, if you like what I do, you know what to do. Go ahead, hit the like button, subscribe. A couple months ago, Bitcoin kind of hit the like, you know, the top of the range that it's in right now, up around like 30,000, 31,000. And, uh... From there, you know, the past like month or so, it's been going down and it's been slowly going down to where it's right now around like, you know, 26, 27,000. Well, it hit about 25,000 um, before it, you know, started to climb back up to like 27. And uh, the time it was going down, stocks for the past like month or two have had a, like a little bit of a rally, right? Um, and it was kind of unexpected, I think, as far as like most analysts were saying. But yeah, that stock rally was, uh, was uh, you know, the last week, I think. It was like the biggest gains. And pretty much what happened was like today, it, it stopped. It started going back down. It sounded like last Friday was really like the end of it. At least as far as a lot of like financial minded people have been talking about, they're saying like they think it's like, you know, time to kind of chill on stocks. Like it had its run up. It's probably got to cool off for a bit. The news last Friday um, after the after the markets closed that, you know, stocks like the, it sounded like the rally was over. It was taking a turn going down. And then I check and I'm like, whoa, OK, crypto crypto just had like a big increase today. Um, the kind of move that it looks like it could be like a reversal, like it's, you know, Maybe 25 was kind of like the bottom for right now, which would make a lot of sense because it's hitting a lot of uh, it's hitting a lot of lines as far as like moving averages. And basically, so right away I'm like, dude, I think what happened, I think I think basically what happened was a lot of people took a lot of profit from uh, the stock market and they put it right into crypto, like instantly, like sell sell the stock market, put that in crypto, and that's what I saw. So I was like, okay. You know, like maybe I should do a video about this, but I'm not sure if it's just like, you know, coincidence that's just like one day. But today that trend seems to be still going, right? So now I'm doing a video about it because I'm not seeing anything else out there with this valuable information that I'm seeing. But what I see is that uh, stocks are starting to, you know, cool down. Crypto's starting to heat back up. So what it really looks like to me is, uh, Money is going flowing right now from the stock market to crypto. Yeah, so how long is this going to last for? No one knows. What do I think? I think at least like the next like short term, like very short term, like, you know, week to month. Um, that's what we're going to see. This is kind of like my prediction. I don't think it's going to be like a huge thing. I just think, you know, because for the most part, these people, I think that are taking gains, taking profit in the stock market. The reason like, you know, they're selling the reason like the uh, that quick rally is ending, like the price are going down because people are starting to sell right now. Um, Yeah, I think the reason that, you know, if, if people just took all the money that the, the profit from the stock market, and put it all on crypto, crypto would be go up like way more than it is right now. So I think people took profit and what they're doing is they're putting like a portion of that profit into crypto, right? Who knows, maybe people are, were taking like 20% of their profits and put into crypto. But for the most part, they were right when they did that because it didn't just crash after it, right? So they knew what they were doing. I think the smart money knew what they were doing when they said, let's get out of the stock market and let's get into crypto right now. So I think for the next week at least, we're gonna see the stock market gradually decline and crypto is gonna gradually climb up. I think uh, really with the way things are going, it's best to like right now just play it safe, which is what I'm trying to do. And uh, yeah, next part to this would be. So yeah, I talked about I talked about what's going on with the stock market. I talked about what's going on with the crypto markets. I talked about how I see a trend starting of money flowing from stocks to crypto. 
I talked about you know how much longer I think that trend is gonna last and I think that you know could be like at least I'm thinking it's probably gonna be at least over like the next week um, could be like the next couple months I don't really want to speculate too much beyond that because I don't really do that I'm more like you know uh, play it by ear like you know, I make my moves today based on what's going on and I don't try to figure out or like try to like think about what's going to happen a month or two months from now. I just roll with the punches and I keep my ear to the street and uh, when things happen, then I make moves. Right. I think too many people have this like strategy of like how things are going to play out and how they see things playing out over the next few years. And they like, you know, that strategy can really hurt them because, you know, nothing's for nothing's for sure nothing's for certain no one knows what the future is going to hold and if you think that like you know things are going to be a certain way and it doesn't go that way and you just keep sticking with that same plan even if things don't go that way it's probably not going to work out too well for you so yeah i feel like there's a lot of uh, a lot of money to be made out here i feel like there's a lot of value out here i feel really grateful to be able to uh have this platform on YouTube and every other platform that's out there so I can provide value to people and I think that's very important that you know anybody can go out here and like find a way they think they can provide value so yeah hopefully you got some value out of what I had to tell you that's about it for what I got today hope you got some at least something out of what I had to say and you know like go hit the like subscribe